first of all, I want to thank everybody for, uh, for coming, and uh, uh, I would also uh, hope everybody's accommodations that came in from out of town were okay. Those were sponsored by my company, so I've got to say thank you to my co-owners, who would be my family, who's been very good about uh, letting me contribute to chess like this, which I love to do. Um, I'd like to say thank you to the membership of the South Carolina Chess Association for allowing us to contribute the money to this prize fund so you didn't have entry fees getting here except for Stephen on the online tournament and everybody in here is getting a prize. I'd like to say thank you to the officers, especially Gene Nix who's uh, been playing tournament director for this tournament, Daniel Smith who supervised the online tournament, Cornell our secretary who's a great cheerleader for us out of Charleston. I'd like to say thank you to this gentleman right here, Klaus Toll, because we were not going to have uh, a tournament or a championship this year, but I heard through the network that Klaus wanted to play over the board, and I thought, well, if our uh, oldest uh, player wanted to play over the board chess, we thought we should see if we could accommodate him. So thank you to the membership uh, for working with us to put this together. I'd like to say thank you to Sam and Mike, who were instrumental in helping us with the format of this, because I actually, Sam was one of the first people I called about it, and it was his idea to take it from a, a four-person, or a, four, uh, a quad, into uh, a six-player round robin, which we were able to accommodate. Also, Mike, you were uh, instrumental in helping us determine what kind of uh, time controls and, and to use in that, I appreciate that. Uh, I want to say thank you to Randy, and Stephen, who have uh, hopefully coming out of retirement, because we hope to see you play some more chess. Stephen, I've seen you uh, take Chumachinko all the way to task back at the uh, years ago, back at the snowstorm. So I know you got it in you. I lost that game. Yeah, you I lost it. Either. You <laughs> lost it, but uh, and Chumachinko won the tournament. He's a 2400 uh, Fide Master. So Stephen, I know you got it in you. Thank you to. Our only international ma master matros for coming to play. Uh, I, I know uh, at the senior tournament, you know, you, you you won the tournament and you still lost a few rating points because of uh, of draws. And I don't know, you know, yet we just appreciate you coming out and supporting us in South Carolina. This is the strongest field ever we've had for a championship that I'm aware of. Are you aware of uh, any stronger Klaus? in South Carolina as far as a, a final state championship? No, we had once uh, also I am a grandmaster. Yeah, but that was, he was out of state, so to have this quality from in-state players where we don't have out-of-state no, no, players. So that, the highest yeah. And so, so today we actually have five master level players uh, in the tournament, and that's just amazing to me. I'm very happy with that. A couple of things to say, and then I'll let you get on with your games. I'm on the, uh, I'm your state delegate for U.S. Chess. I'm also the chair of the National Senior Committee, so I love the fact that we were able to have our uh, senior championship the way we did. Uh, I am Matros Alexander, you won it, and you're, uh, you're barely a senior, you know. We, we put, uh, us older seniors put it in quotes, but you made it to 50, you know, so now, uh, and actually, you have a shot to go to the Invitational Tournament uh, related with the U.S. Open. If you win that, you have a chance to go to St. Louis and play for the U.S. Senior Chess Championship. So, Mike, that leads me to you. You, you have one more year out of the senior context, but next, uh, your birthday, I believe, is in December, right? You will qualify to be another junior senior. Um, so... You know, who knows what will happen next year. Thank you, Gene, you have it.